Good afternoon. Thank you so much for choosing 2 News Oklahoma at noon. I'm Justin Fisher. The state of Oklahoma executed its first death row inmate of 2022 this morning. Donald Grant, the man convicted of a double murder in Dell City, died at 1216 a.m. 2 News Oklahoma's Naomi Kidd is alive in McAllister. She was the only Tulsa reporter inside that room and shares her firsthand account of Grant's execution. Naomi. So, Justin, I was one of five media witnesses that got a chance to see this execution earlier today. In total, in the room that I was in, there were 18 of us, including seven of Grant's family members who came to see that execution. The 16 minute process was peaceful. I'm going to kind of walk you through what I saw. So starting at 10 o'clock sharp, we saw this curtain raise and we saw Grant laying on a gurney earlier this morning. He was given two minutes to say his his last words. Those are the two minutes we actually heard. He did go much longer than that, though. It was a disjointed speech, but I heard him say, I got this. I got this. It's nothing. I love y'all. He was mainly talking to his family during his last words, and then he started to speak in a language we really couldn't understand. It almost sounded like he was speaking in tongues. They cut off the microphone after that two minute mark, but he continued to talk with his family. I continue to heard, hear him say, hold it down, hold down the fort. I'll be back. I'm solid. I saw a tear in his eye as he was talking with his family members during this process. At 10.05, his eyes closed. His breathing was hitched. At 10.09, he lost consciousness. And then 10.16, he was declared dead. His spiritual advisor was with him throughout this entire process. We saw him reading scripture several times. Grant, you'll remember, actually admitted to killing two women. This happened during a robbery back in 2001 in Dell City. Those women, Brenda McLeay and Suzette Smith. We actually got a chance to talk with Brenda's sister after this execution. You'll hear from her coming up at 1230. Reporting live in McAllister, I'm Naomi Kitt, 2 News, Oklahoma.